Welcome to Growy. In this video, we will show you how to install the Growy device. Here's an overview of the different steps. What's in the box? Required tools, measurements and installation, and warnings and tips for using the device. Everything you need to get started is in the box. Let's take a quick look. First, there's the Growy device. It has connectors for EC and pH sensors, as well as for water temperature. 10 tube inlets to connect three of your favorite nutrients, and two for up and down pH solutions. Other than the device, you'll also find a power adapter, an EC sensor, pH sensor, water temp sensor, and five tube bends. Required tools for installation are a drill machine, a Phillips screwdriver, wall plugs and screws, a one quarter inch tube, and a cutter. The device is designed to be hung near the water reservoir you're using. It can be a large or a small reservoir. The Growy device controls up to 100 gallons of water. Place the device in a location where you will have convenient access to it. Before hanging it, make sure that all of the three sensors are able to reach the water in the reservoir you're using. Use the quick start guide to easily mark the drilling points. Hang the device and connect it to a power source. The green light should be blinking. Connect the sensors and put them in the water. Connect the out tubes. Use the tube bends to place them on the edge of the water reservoir. Make sure that the tubes are not in contact with the water. To cut to the right length, measure the distance of each tube after you have connected the tube bends. Connect the in tubes for the pH solutions and the fertilizers you use. Make sure that each tube reaches the bottom of every bottle. The device communicates via Wi-Fi, so make sure to keep your device at a 30 feet range from your home network router. The device itself and its connections are not waterproof. Make sure you keep all the connections dry at all times. Avoid using powder-based fertilizers, as the reduced solubility may cause blockages in the tubes and shorten the life of the device. Ensure you regularly clean the sensors and cables to prevent any buildup. 